actually tracking some rain. What's rain? Well, it's that water that falls out of the clouds. It seems like we haven't had any rain for quite some time. And we are starting to see some rain on the map up in the central mountains around Stanley. And it looks like just on the west side of the Wood River Valley. So Ketchum, Haley, all the way down to Bellevue. We'll probably see some rain here in the next little bit. And some rain falling between Burley and Twin Falls. So if you're driving west, you'll probably go in through most of that as you head off farther west. And farther west, we have a cold front that's right through central Central Washington, Central Oregon, scooping all this moisture our way. This moisture is going to help clean up our air around here, get rid of a lot of the smoke. Uh, ETA on whether we'll get, when we'll get some rain for Pocatello Falls will be later this evening at the earliest. It could hold off until late tonight, early tomorrow morning. And right now, it's just a chance. So we're 50-50 on this for the Snake River Plain. But definitely some clouds well into the overnight and certainly a little bit on the warmer side, especially for places like Idaho Falls where we'll see a low temperature in the 48 degrees instead of the mid-40s. Pocatello will be in the 50s again. 52 expected, Blackfoot at 51. Now for the Central Mountains, more than just a chance. Rain likely with a risk of thunderstorms tonight. Low temperatures, low range from just above freezing by a few degrees in Stanley to about 10 degrees warmer in Mackey, 47 expected there. For the upper highlands, western Wyoming, more clouds and smoke than anything. So a little bit of a blanket over the top of us. That'll keep all of us in the 40s, including Yellowstone. Low of 41 will be in the mid 40s in Jackson. Now for the southeast corner, clouds. It is trying to sprinkle some rain along the Wyoming-Idaho border, but uh, more sprinkles than anything, I think, this evening. The real serious rain, if you want to call it that, will be late tonight, but there is a chance of some moisture nonetheless. Maybe we'll get some measurable rain. That'll be nice. 51 in Malad City, Soda Springs tonight, 46. And then tomorrow, I think rain is likely. Pretty good bet in the morning and in the afternoon, and we could see some thunderstorms over the southeast corner. Look at the highs tomorrow. Wow, you know, going from the 80s, 70s to only in the 60s. Soda Springs, 62. That's light jacket sweater weather for sure. Rain likely for the upper highlands in western Wyoming. A wet start to the last weekend of summer and a cool one. Island Park only 56. Jackson only in the 50s for high. Only in the 50s in Ledorn and Stanley. Not even 60 in Mackey. 59 there. A little bit warmer up the road in Chalice at 63. But that's still cooler than it usually or it has been lately. And for the Snake River Plain. A chance you may see some rain in the morning, risk of thunderstorms, then the wind really picks up later in the day with high temperatures, about 15 degrees cooler than they were this afternoon. Southeast Idaho, 7 dealer seven day forecast. Last Sunday of summer, sunny and 73. Last day of summer, hey, we warm up to 84, and then it looks like for the first day of fall, we're at 81 degrees. So, hey, we're going to warm up some more as we go into the new season. Idle Falls, seven day forecast. Definitely a potential of being a stormy day tomorrow. It's cooler and windy for sure. You can bank on those two things. With lots of sunshine, though, on Sunday, the wind will die down. And then Tuesday, first day of fall, 79 degrees with a partly sunny sky. And for the Teton area, a stormy, wet, cool start to the weekend. A little better for your Sunday. Uh, no liquid sunshine. We'll have the dry kind, and we'll take that dry sunshine all the way into with some clouds mixed in on Tuesday with a high of 70. For the Central Mountains, a stormy start to the weekend. And then coming out of the weekend, sunshine galore. We're in the mid-70s on Tuesday, back in the 80s next Thursday and Friday.